What's up, everyone on YouTube? It's your boy, the Memphis Accelerate, coming at you live with Lucky Draws, the show where I take a look at whatever deck I feel like, have a good time. Halloween day three. Let's go, Madolce. Of course, you gotta have candy if you're gonna have Halloween, and we got ourselves our Madolce deck. It's pretty simple and basic, but it does all the things Madolce's like to do, which is swarming, summoning. I'm doing the pudding ses shenanigans with my Madolce knights, because this trap is. Legit terrifying. So we're going to have ourselves a good time with today's deck. Have ourselves good times all around. Now let's get started with our lucky draws. Alrighty, first opponent. We want to try and go first, and we're going to go first, so very nice. Alright. Um, it's an alright hand. I would have really liked my pudding says sure, but... Let's go for some other stuff. Let's go for Angeli. I can tribute Angeli in order to summon... Uh, almost. I almost clicked the wrong button. We want Hoot Cake. Because Hoot Cake, I can banish one of my monsters in the grave. Summon another monster. You want Mess and Gelato. Because then you get a search. He's a bit of a weird thing searching, but... I can get my ticket. Alright, so now what we're going to do... Uh, we want to activate the ticket. I want to make Sis Church. Hello. And then you want to activate Chateau. That way your stuff goes back. And I get to add to my hand Puddin Sessur. And no, I do not want to special summon it. I want to actually have it in my hand. That way I can special summon it from there. Be like, hello. And then you get to summon another puddin'. And I'm going to summon the puddin' Sess in my deck. Who will get 800 points because I have nothing in the grave. I'm going to set this here card and call it a turn. Should be pretty good in set since these, uh, you know, Sistar will protect my spell traps that are very important. Uh, so long as I'm pointing to Madolche's. And since I have nothing in the graveyard, I can negate a monster effect, and my opponent will be a sad panda. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's just go for battle. Let's just go for the diddly old battle and see what we're up against. I'm waiting. You got some mirror forces or something? Oh, it's ghost tricks. Interesting. Very interesting. So now he's going to flippy flip me down. All right, so he's flipping up Zhang Shi, and unfortunately he'll flip Puddin Sess, which will... Oh, no, he didn't do that. What a silly person. But Oche Knights, you're negated, and you lose whatever that was. You tried to add a card, you lost a card. And Puddin Sess will pop one of his cards after doing battle. That's the beauty of Puddin Sess, people. Used to be garbage, now with Puddin Sessur, she's a beaut. And I'm going to flip this back face up. Alright, so we're up against Ghost Tricks. I'm, I'm still getting ready to play Ghost Tricks myself, don't worry. I have to wait until Halloween to do them, and then I will do them for sure. Uh, but for now, we got Transients, which is pretty nice. Pretty nice. Could go for Saryuja, but I don't really want to. Let's just keep attacking. Now that I know we're up against Ghost Tricks, unless she's playing Yeti, Puddin says sure. Or now she's called P Petting says sure. That's weird. Uh, regardless, he's flipped me and he's got the fairy. So now he gets to reset one of his cards. All right. I can agree with this. Your fairy's dead, though. Or, no, it's not. Uh, let me think how this... Let me try to remember how this works. I'm going to get rid of the fairy, because she's going to just be annoying. Now that I know what that is, I can set my transients and flip my cards back up. Uh, luckily... No, if he has a skate... Well, I can't flip that up, but that's... You know, that's whatever. Uh, no, no, I don't want I don't want any monsters in the grave right now. If I tribute summon my Petting Session or whatever the heck she's called now, uh, she'll go to the grave and she won't come back, and I don't want that. I want my stuff to be uh, not in the grave, and I'm also going to be negating that, sir. I'm sorry. Negating you will be having. I like your name though, Spooky Moki. I was expecting Moki Mokies, but apparently not. 
All right, now it's our turn again. Uh, let's go ahead and flip. And uh, effect of a Dolce monster. Hmm. All right, here's what we're going to do. Silly stuff is incoming. I'm going to tribute Puddin' Sessure for Puddin' Sess. This seems wasteful, but I'm going to activate a new Chateau, which will put my Sessure back, and I'm going to get another Madolce. And no, I'm not going to negate my own shite. Uh, add Magellan, and no, I do not want a special summon. I want to have that switch, which will happen eventually. Let's go for battle. Let's hit Jiang Shi. He is ripe and waiting. Oh no, he had scare. He's gonna flip one of my dudes face down. Why did you keep why did you summon that? Should have kept that in your hand. It's a hand trap after all. Good old Jack Frost. And now I'm gonna pop uh, your sack card because I don't trust it. I do not trust whatever Arg. Ah, but guess what? I get the return. No, I'm going to put this back in my deck. That's all good. I don't need to have Puddin' Cess in my hand. I already have one on the board. Uh-huh. All right. So we're pretty good. Could I flip that? All right, doesn't matter. Uh, Ghost Trick's not known for the recovering from having nothing, and yes, he did surrender. Uh, good effort, Ghost Trick, my man, but unfortunately, I had too much for you. Let's go for duel number two and keep this up. All righty, second of volume, and we'll see what we got. We don't get to pick, which is a little sad, but I'm going first anyway, so it's all good. And I've got lots of negation and stuff. Um, yeah, that doesn't help me. If I had the field spell, it'd be nice, but I don't. So let's just go for. I'm just gonna keep calling you Puddin' Sessure. It's easier to say. So let's go ahead and summon Puddin' Hello, I am the Sess of Pudding. I'm going to go ahead and set my negatey stuff. And your move. So all's good. If he, like, regex me, it'll suck. But I've got hoot cake for that. So all in all, not bad, not bad. Ah, uh, he's playing Pandalum Dragons. Unfortunately, cannot do anything about that. Because I didn't put this over here. But regardless, uh, we'll see how this goes. Unfortunately, him summoning a bunch of big beat sticks is kind of my weakness. Uh, especially that particular one, because it's kind of uh, bigger. It's a little bit bigger. What can I say? Uh, it would be nice if he'd use an effect. <laughs> but I don't think he's going to use an effect of a monster. Uh, no, I he did. Let's go, Medolce Knights. I negate you. And then I'm shuffling that back into the deck. Very nice. I'm sorry, are you sad because I did all that to your stuff? Well, too bad. So now what are you going to do? I have shuffled your stuff. And now he's going for the Electromite, which I will negate, of course. Um, I don't think... Yeah, that, that shouldn't affect his Pendulum Scales or anything. I'm, I'm still going to negate Electromite, because why wouldn't I do that? Uh, but he is just going to Pendulum Summon the thing. No, wait, he already Pendulum Summoned. Yeah, he did. He already did. What am I talking about? I don't know. He's probably going to kill Puddin' Says Shooter, though. Uh, and when he does that, you know, she'll go back to my deck and all that good stuff, which is good. She's safe. If I draw her, it's perfect. Uh, but now I need to... I need to blow up his scales. That's what I need to do. Uh, how many? Mo I have no monsters in the grave, which kind of stinks. Um, let's go for Chateau. Sadly, I have no Medolce's to shuffle back to deck. Would have been nice if I did. If I did, it would have been a perfect something. All right, and let's go ahead and summon Hoot Cake. At least it's a 2K beat stick. Let's go ahead and beat over Electromite. Be like, get out of here, pleb. Because I'm a, I'm a pretty princess, damn it. Quote me on that. Memphis is a pretty princess. I still don't know why he gets to act. I guess it's because it's still kind of on the field. I don't know. I feel like he's like in a weird limbo. He should be dead, but he's not. That's just kind of my opinion. I really should have saved. Well, no, if I'd done that, I would have had to pop Electromite or something. Eh, it doesn't matter. 
I'm just gonna end my turn. Be like, get over this. Because if you shuffle my, if you get rid of Hoot Cake, it'll go back to my deck, and I'll summon another monster. Get rid of Pudding Sess. I still get another. Well, I get another. Get another card. But you know what I mean. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Do you know what I mean? You know what I mean. So luckily, we've gotten rid of his big scale, which is usually the more important one. But he had another. He had another one. Of course he did. Of course he had another bloody one. Now he's just going to summon that annoying pendulum dragon thingy back. Luckily, this doesn't actually do anything. If it did something, I would be in trouble. And unfortunately, he's going after my princess. Uh, but I still get to pop one of his cards, so... Eh. Eh. That is the best effect ever. Uh, what is this doing? Let's see. Destroy a card in your pendulum zone. Place an on eyes pendulum monster in the egg. Okay. Um. No. And then ticket lets me add another one. Let's go ahead. Put in the shooter. <laughs> How do you like that, pendulum dragons? I have stopped all your things. What now will you do? I'll tell you what, you'll do absolutely nothing because I'm going to put in cess. Princess, princess, sure, gonna be all up in your junk. I don't know what that means, but I'll sing it anyway. Let's attack with all the things. Attacking. I don't think that's, is that game? I don't think it is. Ah, oh, it's close though. If only I ran cowboy. Obviously, for obvious reason, I did not run the cowboy. Thought about it, decided not to. Um, very tempted to go for Tianamizu. You know what? I am going to do it anyway. Hello, I am the queen. I shall now detach my material. Get these two back. And then I'm going to... No... And go buy your scales. And then ticket. We'll add. Um, where it says your. And then no. <laughs> and I've already used your effect, so I'm just gonna set a card to make him think it's a trap card and end my turn. I think we're pretty good. You know, I've got Tiar Misu, one of the most obnoxious Xyz monsters ever printed. Uh-oh, what is this? Uh, okay, you don't get that effect. Normal summon target at level 3 or lower perform power, blah, 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 blah. Okay, he's just going out on his own terms. He went out on his own terms. So, there's a great duel against Pendulum Dragons. Let's go for duel numero the third and keep it up some more. All right, our third opponent of the day. Let's see if we can keep doing what we like to do. Uh, this guy's called Itolus. I don't know what that is, but it's, uh, it's a neat, neat little name. Let's see. Ooh. Well, I got magic. I, I, I always say, I always say, ooh, when I don't start with Puddin Sessure, because I like her so much. But whenever you start with Magellina, at the very least, it's something. Although I might get Ash Blot. Yeah, there she is. That's fair. I run it too, so I can't complain too much. As much as I'd like to complain some more, I cannot complain too much. But at least I've got my own Ash Blossom. So when he starts... No, I'm waiting for him to play Pot of... Um, uh, well, not Extravagance. Uh, Pot of Desires or something. And then I'm going to steal his stuff. Alright, you've stolen my girl. And you're playing Cybers of some form. And you're playing Sky Strikers. All right. Uh, let's see. Normal special. You special some of this card from the hand with its cards in your graveyard. Something, something. Shiki diggy. Be like, no. Go away. I don't care for you, brandish maidens. I just don't. You can't attack with that. Now give it back. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. Not bad, not bad. I mean, I, I'd like some other things. That's for sure. 
One type of monster. That's going to be slightly bad. Um, ever so slightly. I don't like that. Because... Oh yeah, now I can only have spellcasters. Shoot. Fine, take 1900 to the face. There, I hope you're happy. Rivalry of warlords. I hope you try to search a card next turn. And then I'm gonna get rid of it. You hear me? You hear me, angry face? Uh, you better hear me. Alright. Alright, so what does this do again? Target a monster in the graveyard, shuffle into deck. Okay. Just straight up recover your monster. That's, I, I, I can't say anything else about it. That's all it does. It just straight up recovers a guard. Uh, certainly a more uh, lockdown-y version of Sky Strikers. Never really a fan of lockdown-y Sky Strikers because they're supposed to be dead and they keep coming back. I keep seeing Sky Strikers using like Mystic Mine. And that should be all I need to say about it. It's just they're playing Mystic Mine, and it's disgusting. It's the, it's the steps they've had to take to stay relevant. You know, Kagari's limited. Widow Anchor's gone. Multi-rolls at one. Am I getting the ban list right? I think so. See, see, see. There, there it is. There it is. There it is. I have Spell Trap removal. Uh, but I'm going to have to draw into it, so I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead until I get out of this, this. I'll be back as soon as I'm out of this, this. So, uh, hold tight, everybody. All right, my opponent foolishly blew up his own spell mining cave. What a fool. Uh, granted, I still can't summon that, but I drew another Magellane. Let's search out things, because now my monster effects... Have free reign. Never mind. I despise you with every fiber of my human being. He also gave me uh, his Hercules base for some reason. I think it was so I couldn't like attack him directly or something. Or because he gets to draw off me destroying his stuff. That's really stupid. That is dumb and you're dumb for doing it. Okay, for real, though, that is actually a good idea, now I think about it. You give your opponent an equipped spell that prevents them from attacking directly, and when they battle monsters, uh, then you get to Ash Blossom them, because they've been Ash Blossoming you all day. Uh, target a monster, banish that, or special summon it to your field, but they cannot attack. Still doesn't negate the effect, my friend. No, it does not. No searching for you. That's right. You've been doing it to me this whole duel. Um, let me guess. Metal Faux Fusion, yep. Metal Faux Fusion, the good old draw engine. The good old draw... Do, do people who run that even run anything to... Oh, no. Just gonna get rid of... Oh, we got rid of Joy Spring. No, no, and nothing. You get nothing. You get to keep that, but you get nothing. Uh, let me think about this. Uh, Angeli, you're not a, f you're not a princess. But I think this is game unless he draws like Battle Vader. So, that's a thing. Go ahead, draw your last pathetic card, little Yugi. Because that's game against Sky Strikers. Go back to the trash. You're dead. Stay dead. Duel 4 coming up. Alrighty, our fourth and final opponent of the day shall be against a guy called Diego Dino Boy. I imagine that means this is dinosaurs of some form. Uh, unfortunately, did not get all the things that are cool and sexy. I mean, granted, I'm still gonna get, you know, Pudding Says Sure. Pudding Says Sure is going to. Uh, yeah, you have to be special summoned for that to work, sadly. Ugh. I'm, try I'm just going to do the Angeli thing. I want to do more combos and get more stuff, you know what I mean? Still would like my Medolce Knights, but sadly do not have Medolce Knights. It's a thing. You want Medolce Knights, but you can't get it all the time. I mean, I could get it right now, but it wouldn't be as effective. 
I'd rather get, like, ticket. I'd rather get my ticket, sir. Thank you. Let's go for ticket. I don't need no pendulums. Not yet. Go for the tart. Uh, you two. Hello, I'm the start. Nice to meet you. And let's go for field spell. Be like, get the princess. Uh, where'd she go? There's one in my hand, which kind of stinks. But at least I got one on the board. Be like, your move, bro. All right, let's see what we're up against. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Sadly, these are kind of dead draws. Messing Gelato has to be special summoned and stuff to work. Uh, and Puncess is, of course, level 5. So, that's unfortunate. We're up against Dank Magicians. The Magicians of Dankness, they are called. Uh-huh. I'm going to guess that's Eternal Soul, because Dark Magician player. So... It's a bit of an issue, because he doesn't have any monsters. He has no monsters. How am I supposed to stop him? I'll try Magilene and see if that works. See if I can get another Pudence Assure. Kind of low-key kind of wish I had bore a load right now. Yeah, there's Eternal Soul, and sadly I do not have the ability to stop it. If I did, I would not be freaking out right now. Not that I'm actually freaking out or anything. I'm just low-key being like, that's not good because he's going to banish my stuff. Oh. Well, that's fine. I couldn't use that card anyway. Be that way. Um, target a card. Destroy that target. Okay. That's an option. That's certainly an option. I can do that thing. Let's go for Puddin' Sessure. I have a plan. Is it a good plan? No. Am I going to do it anyway? Yes. Alright, so Puddin' Sessure. Let's go ahead and summon more things. Um. Oh. Okay. But you've already used a Toynal Soul, so... You can't use it again this turn, so I imagine you have something else. Um... Summon the Puddin' Cess from my hand. Could make Saryuja. Could make a lot of things. Um. Uh. Ah, Tiarmisu. Oh, wait. I have nothing in the graveyard, so I can't do that. Well, screw it. I'm attacking with everything. Did you seriously not have anything to protect yourself? Are you trying to bait me here? Dark Magician, what, 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 what is this? You should have left the dang... Okay, here we go. He's doing something now. Never mind. He ran away. Alrighty. There's a fourth win. Um, I'm pushing my luck, but I'll go for one more. Let's go for one more duel, and then we'll call it a day. Alrighty, final opponent of the day for real. Well, let's see, we're going first again, so that's nice. Can we get a whole bunch of negations? Well, we got one, and that's good enough by my book. Let's go ahead and... I can do a lot of stuff with this hand, actually. I'm going to go ahead and get my pudding sess out. Uh, get her on the board. Uh, let's go for the Angeli combo. Be like, hello. Get me a hoot cake. Thank you. Be like, I'm going to do my hoot cakes and you can't stop me. So I'm going to go ahead and bring out my messing gelato. Could, I, I mean, right now I could go for like Saryuja and draw a bunch of cards, but I don't really need to. Could, but I'm not going to. I'm not going to do that. Now, let's go ahead for... Uh, Sis chart, and I'm gonna put her right here. And then I'm gonna go ahead and field spell. And then I'm gonna go ahead and set to. And I'm pretty set. I've got my Madolce Knights. I've got Twin Twisters and something to discard. Granted, I gotta do Knights before Twin Twisters, or else I can't use this. But in any, yeah, with any luck, uh, that shouldn't be a problem. 
should not be a problem unless we're playing against, I, I, I don't know, some, something, something, man. One of them things, the man that doesn't like it when you do those things, man. All right. Uh, let's see. Okay, we're up against Vendrez. Played them yesterday. It was fun. Send zombie, special zombie. All right. Cool. You have summoned a corpse. Very cool. Very cool. You have summoned another corpse. Unfortunately, that is the sort of corpse I cannot allow, my friend. Uh, Loki, I'm, I'm sorry. I can't allow Unizambi. Unizambi, too good. I'm going to have to say no. So that's the gate, and I'm, you're losing a random card. Uh, you can do the other effect, I think. Pretty sure he can still do the... the um, which effect was he picking? Sent from deck. He can still discard one, but I know he doesn't want to do that. That's the thing about Vendrets. They need to be on the board to do all their good effects when they do the ritual summon. Uh, I wonder what he lost. I'm just, I'm very curious. Whenever I use knights, I'm always curious. What did my opponent lose? I mean, I know what he's about to. Oh. Oh. No, my everything. Um, yeah, give me my pudding says shirt back to my hand. Not that I can get her, you know, because, uh, sis tarts in the grave. So I need hoot cake or else I can't use this. That's the, that's the one problem with sis tart is she doesn't shuffle herself back. Uh, if she did, she'd be 10 times better. That I can live with. Let's go for Mufu. Mufu will summon a Madolce from the hand. And I will summon this one. Because the weird thing about Messenger Gelato is you need a beast on the field to make it work. Uh, I never figured out why that was, but that is the case. I am going to go and do another Chateau. Uh, just so I can do... I think I'm going to just beat this guy down. Uh, I'm not sure if this is an OTK, but it's very, very close. Uh, where is... I want the one out of my deck so I don't draw it. Let's go for Battle Phaser. And then potentially go for Saryucha. We'll see how it goes. We'll see what we get rid of. I might go for Saryucha. Just, just to show that I can do Saryucha. I might do Saryucha. Okay, so he is going to survive this. He did survive. A very epic Black Rose Dragon, by the way. Very nice tech. Very old tech, but a very good one, as you can clearly see. Luckily, Madolce Chateau. Well, I, I got another Chateau, so it doesn't really matter there. But regardless, let's go. And Saryuja, where are you? Oh, yeah, I can't summon Saryuja. There was a re it's because of... Um, uh, I forget what the reason is, but I can't go for Saryuja, which kind of stinks because I wanted to go for Saryuja because I haven't done it. Uh, I think it's, oh yeah, it's Puddin Sashur, I think. Uh, yeah, it's because I'm Puddin Sashur. Can't summon anything but Madolches. And now he's getting Unizambi back. That's not good. Now he's going to start dumping zombies. And that's like the thing he does the best. So the question is, he, he, he's going to definitely go for a Balladrock, isn't he? He's going to dump a Banshee, and then he's going to like discard Balladrock that's been in his hand this whole time. I'm going to guess, kicking myself again, I do not, well, I guess it wouldn't have mattered. But I'm still kicking myself for not running freaking Cowboy. Hopefully nobody in the comments will kick my butt too mad for that one. Got rid of, oh yeah, because he can ritual summon from his graveyard. Right. Yes. Reveal of Vendred. Okay, you got Camara, so you can summon this thing. Uh, in attack mode. Okay, he's definitely going for another something. Another synchro? No, he just went for savior. Okay, that works too. That guy is powerful because he battles me and then he weakens my monsters. Uh, he can also just get a Vendred card back. Alright, interesting. 
He's certainly trying, and he's certainly getting stuff. So I'm about to say goodbye to at least possibly two, three of my cards. Uh, this lets him banish my cards. Uh-oh. That's bad. Uh, and then my monsters get weaker because of that thing. And he can banish a special summon monster. That's not good. So I'm going to lose at least three of my cards. I mean, Mooful, he's going to yeah, beat over Mooful. And who is he going to banish? He banished the Puddin' Sess. Oof. Alright. That's not good, folks. Because I don't really have a way of beating over his things right now. That's the thing. And now he's just going to make himself bigger. He's going to make himself big. I can't believe. I, I, I had it within 700 life points. Um... Yes, actually, I'm going to get that back to my hand, because then I can mess in gelato and stuff. It's a good point. Uh, still, mean, I still can't put in Seshur and all that, but I can do all the other stuff I want to do. All right, and then this will go back to my hand. He's got a mazook in the grave. So, that's a problem. Okay, he did not kill Messenger. Ah, he didn't want me to search. Clever. Clever indeed. Um, Go for Puddin' so sure. Uh, reduce its level by one. Yep, 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 yep. Unfortunately, my one problem right now is... Um, let me think about this. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to get another Puddin' Sess. Yeah, the one problem right now is if I go for, like, Tiramisu, it won't work. Because he'll just negate it and stuff. Which kind of stinks, let me tell you what. Uh, one, two, three, four, four, four. Because that's not a quick effect, so he'll just, like, banish Tiramisu the minute I attempt to do that. Also, why are you not giving my monster... Oh, it's because of the Chimera, right. Um... Battle, Feizu? Let's go ahead and attack the Savior and... Ba Let's bait out Savior. Let's bait him out so I can get rid of him. Yeah, and then he gets he gets rid of my other things. And I have a normal summon Mewful. Ooh, ah, ooh, ooh, ah, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes, I am a monkey. Don't don't question. Do not dare question the monkey. Uh, the one problem though is oh wait no Tiaramisu. What am I talking about? There are no problems. Tiaramisu is here. So in that regard, I'm not going to do that. I am going to normal summon Mufu, who will then summon Messenger Auto back. He's already used that effect like a silly person. So now I'm going to get a ticket. I'm going to get ticket. Activate ticket. Come forth, my queen. Save us in this hour of need. Yeah, I bet you forgot that I had this. Let's go ahead and detach one. Get these two back. Because I already have a field spell, so I don't need the other ones. Uh, no. I want those back so I can bounce both of these to the decks. And then I can get freaking Puddin' says sure back anyway. Oh, <laughs> uh, you made some you made some good attempts there, my friend, but unfortunately you are screwed. I mean, granted, he has double mazook. But he doesn't have anything but this to revive with those mazooks, because he can't revive the ritual monster. So, what have you? I'm curious. I mean, if he drew you in a zombie, he could probably do something. I don't know what something, but something. Definitely something. A nasty something. So, we'll see how it goes, man. Okay, Mazook. You gotta bound, you gotta bring back the revenants or something? Granted, if he made like 
Ah, uh, what could he make? He'd go for Utopia the Lightning. Ooh, that would be bad. No, I think he's just going for Revenants. I think it's just going for Revenants because he's like his beat stick, and he surrendered. All right, good, good effort, Vendridge. You gave me a more of a fight than you showed originally, but in the end, Madolce's too sweet for you. Let's go for end screen time. Madolce's, everybody, did perfect today, and I hope very much that you enjoyed it because I know Madolce's are a fan favorite and all that, and I wanted to do them right, which is why I didn't do them yesterday, and so I hope very much that you enjoyed it today. Leave a like if you did. Maybe consider subscribing if you enjoyed it very much. Uh, tomorrow, I really want to do Vendreds, but I've never done them before, so I'll probably just do Zombies again, and then Vendreds after that, something like that. Uh, but regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you guys again next time, and have a very spooky Halloween. See you next time.